Boats from several islands in the region are expected to compete in the St. Lucia Game Fishing Association's International Billfish Tournament, set to take place here from October 16 to 20. The Ministry of Youth Development and Sports is partnering with the association through its alternative sports program to revive game fishing in St. Lucia. What we're trying to do as a sport is for the ministry also with for the and then the association is to develop it is to let the, let the public know that alternative sports is is a, is a thing um, yes it's expensive some of the sports are cheap some of them are expensive um, this being one of them but it is a sport that you know generates income um, can become a, a, a big enough uh, tournament that can bring in wider uh, bigger countries' uh, participants into, into the country. Hugh Pilgrim will be the tournament director. His responsibility includes the smooth running of the entire tournament. The boats will go varying ranges, but at least four miles out. Some may go you know, between St. Lucia and St. Vincent and fish south. Some may go between St. Lucia and Martinique. Some may go as far as 20, 40 miles out. So they follow different signs and they can go exceedingly far or they can actually catch fish sometimes four or five miles offshore. They come back on the same day. So whatever they catch has to be recorded on the, on, on the day um, and, and hung and weighed and, and witnessed by officials of the St. Lucia Game Fish Association. Republic Bank supports the tournament coming in as platinum sponsors. Senior country lead Gisela Claxton feels the tournament has the potential to benefit the country economically and in other areas of development. We are very proud as a bank um, to be sponsoring such an event and to be the title sponsors. Um, this is actually in keeping with, as a signatory, to the UN principles of responsible banking and sustainable development practices. It is important for us that this tournament continues to align with the practice of conservation fishing. So in this vein, we are, we are here to support the, ton the, the tournament committee in executing this successful event. Organizers are expecting a fleet of approximately 30 boats to compete in the upcoming tournament. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.